friends, I am Dr. Suchita Parab, a board certified dermatologist practicing at Borivli in Damagri Skin Clinic. Let me talk about acne today, or also known as pimples, as it's a very common skin problem. So what is acne? Acne is when your hair follicles get blocked with the oil and the dead skin and result into blackheads, whiteheads, zits, you know, red boils and uh, sometimes even bigger nodules. So why does it happen? It's under the influence of hormones, then the oil that our skin produces and uh, the kind of lifestyle that we have and also diet influences it. So let me give you quick uh, acne skin care tips that you can do at home. To begin with cleansing. So cleanse your face twice in a day with a gentle cleanser, no scrubbing, avoid alcohol based cleansers. Secondly, uh, if you are doing some activity which involves sweating then you may additionally wash your face after that. Then uh, moisturizer. Moisturization go for which are non-acnegenic, non-comedogenic and apply over dry areas as dry skin will again flare your acne. Uh, and sunscreen, yeah. So I would say go for sun protection, like use a physical sun protection like uh, sunscreen and which is a physical block, an umbrella or you can cover your face when you're going out in the sun. Not to forget uh, shampooing your hair regularly. If you don't, at least in this Indian weather, you should shampoo twice a day. So that will take care of the oil that comes from your scalp and again blocks your, clogs your pores. Then uh, pillow covers. The pillow covers have to be changed at least twice a week because the oil and the dead skin on the pillow cover rubs against your face and again flares up your acne. Uh, not to forget diet. Diet plays a very important role. So two things to be avoided strictly is dairy. So restrict your dairy intake to less than uh, 200 ml which includes your curd, your cheese, your butter, all of this curd and uh, refined sugars. So avoid food that is high in sugar or you say that is high glycemic index. This includes all your refined flour items like uh, bread, pizza, burger, biscuit, toast. Try to avoid this. What you have is have plenty of water, have fresh fruits, try to have salads, try to go for uh, fruits that are yellow in color because they are rich in vitamin A, vitamin C like oranges, papaya, carrots, they are all good for your skin. Now basically I will give you something that you can try at home like tea tree oil. So tea tree oil has to be diluted in water and applied only over the area which is affected. Um, use it very carefully, first go for a test patch because some people are uh, sensitive to tea tree oil, it's quite a strong molecule. And the second thing that I have seen benefits is the aloe gel, the aloe vera plant, the gel from the aloe vera leaf applied onto the red swollen uh, acne. That this again should be diluted and applied on the acne. Now in spite of doing all of this, if your skin is still flaring, if the acne is still flaring, then I must say you should visit a dermatologist. Uh, the expert will guide you, all kinds of acne can be treated, so normally we give you a prescription of certain antibiotics and certain basic creams uh, which contain salicylic acid, benzoyl peroxide, even uh, vitamin A derivatives which we commonly call as retinoids and uh, some people may take a little longer time but acne can be treated and they have to be treated because first of all we don't want to, uh, you to suffer with the acne. Secondly, the, they leave marks, they leave scars, which require little solid treatments. So I would suggest and also suggest your parents that don't take your acne lightly. Treat it, treat it as fast as possible and uh, hope this video helps you.